Lord, how are y'all been? Look, I got a new club here that I had it for two months. I can tell you on honest review. And uh, this is a Titleist TSR2 for hybrid. Let's get into it. During the fitting, I had two options. I had a Cobra hybrid, it's a three hybrid. And uh, I had a TSR2 uh, three hybrid. In the midst of fitting into these, I needed a 230 total club. I hit both of them. 230 and actually before i had this one a tsr2 uh four i had a three because that's where i you know want it but i hit that a little too far and um you know i need 230 so he bumped me down to a four hybrid and uh I hit 230. And, and what's crazy, guys, is I was there getting fitted with you. And yeah. what's crazy is that now he's hitting this one over 230 almost. Like, he's carrying yeah. this almost 230 now. So, in the two months that I was playing with this without doing a you know a video with it, um, I was just hitting it like two, 240 once. Downhill, slightly at Whitestone. One of, my, one of my favorite courses here in Texas. So, the reason why I didn't go with a Cobra was because it wasn't it wasn't adjustable it wasn't adjustable on the fly and i need that sometimes because it's, it'd be too hard to close my hands because of some my reason so without further ado let's hit some shots and let's see what this bad baby can do there you go there it is. that's a straight shot that's a so that was a beautiful baby draw that's what i'd be seeing on course you know 223 carry some 230 total Sometimes I get that extra rollout. What was the total on that one? Uh, the total was 239. That's beautiful. That's, That's perfect. Beautiful. And and it was high enough to, to stick on the green. So if you got a long part three, a 230, 225 part three, you could bring that bad baby out and carry the green because how, how, how high is it hitting? Six, that was 60 feet. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that, that's perfect. That's money. Let's see another one. That was a beautiful shot right there. Talk about them numbers. What was them oh, that was a good shot. That was a beautiful shot. The shaft that I went with was a uh, Mitsubishi Chemical AB Series Blue. It is a 65 gram stiff. And oh boy, this feels really good. I played 36 holes with this. And uh, really, it's beautiful. So you know we got to take this to the course. Uh, let's see how this perform and let's get it. Bro, that's on the green. Is that on the green? Wow, you hit the green, bro. You stuck the green. Bro, I stuck that green. I stuck that green, 230. That four hybrid club, boy, let's talk about it. Yeah. That's my number right here, like 230 to 220. That's the club I pull out. And uh, y'all about to see how far that is away from the pin with a four hybrid. What you think of that, Dad? You like that? That, he hits that four hybrid so good. I mean, the numbers that y'all saw on TrackMan wasn't, I mean, not TrackMan, Flight Scope was not a lie. He just hit that off of an uphill lie. The ball was above his feet and he hit the green. Baby draw, baby high draw, beautiful. And hit the green, and it was high. It was a, it was a good trajectory to stick the green. You will see. What you think, Roman? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ah. <laughs> All right, so here I am. I hit it a little too far. I got a little power on me. Where's that uh, divot? Uh, right here. There's the divot, and it rolled a little bit. But, like I said, this is my number, like 220 to 230. That's my number, I and mean, I'm like 10 yards away. So, one chip, one putt, par, and I'm out of here. Let's see Jay. Oh, oh, oh. That is definitely a one putt. Yes, sir. So tell me, how does the club feel in transition as you take it from the top through through impact? So I was looking for something that is lightweight. I mean, what, what shaft is this? 65 stiff, something that's lightweight that can withstand 36 holes, 36 holes. And that's what I was aiming for. The five wood that I had before this was like an 80 stiff. It was super heavy and I'm so tired and stuff. After 18, I just need something light. And this is the club, the whole four of Whitestone. It's very tight with these trees right in my way. So that's when I pull out my four hybrid. This, this is a favorite club. 
yeah, like it's so low. But I mean, it's good though. Did it get through? Yeah, it got through. It's going to the left. So it's perfect. Yeah, it's pretty good. So this is a different case where I'll bring this uh, four hybrid out right where I'm underneath a tree or something and uh, I need to punch it out real quick. I'll bring out this club. I, I just hit it right there. That's perfect. Like it'll just get me out of the tree so that I have a chip left or I got a putt left. You on the fringe? Yeah, I'm right around the fringe area, yeah. All right, so like that type of shot, it's like a take your medicine type. I don't know if y'all know about that, but I mean, this is a easy par right here, you know, get up and down, one chip, one putt. <laughs> that about concludes the video. Yes, sir. This club was phenomenal. Great purchase. Uh, great time spent trying to know what club to get. Because I had many options. Like I say, this is really good for tight fairways. Like hole four. Very tight. And I have to hit that four hybrid. Take that out. Uh, right there, 230. Um, it's a nice approach shot on a par five where I got a 230. Oh, yeah. Bring that out. Uh, y'all yeah. all like i said this is good all-around club don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe and you already know it's glorious